Okay, so in the EA Launcher, trying to move the location of a game file, going to be trying to move Battlefield 1. So you're just going to click on it. Right now, go to Manage, View Properties. It is on a drive E. Browse, let's browse that location. Here it is. Okay, now I'm just going to copy the file to the new location. The new location is going to be on my main drive because let's say I wanted to use this game a lot more often and I want my load times to be better. So I'm just going to be, this is where I've decided to keep it. Now I'm just going to paste it here. And if something goes wrong, I copied it and I didn't delete it, cut. So it will be still here. Now, the next thing we want to do is close EA. So we're going to let that transfer and we will finish closing EA. So I'm going to right click on Windows, go up here to Task Manager. I'm going to find EA and get rid of it. End task, end task there. Now, next thing we need to do is click on Windows. I'm going to go Reg for Reg Edit. Now we're going to go to Reg Edit. I'm going to hit yes to that. Okay, just to get out of here quickly, we're going to go to Local Machine. Open that up. We're going to go to Software and we're going to look for EA right here. Now we're doing Battlefield 1, so I'm just going to right click on this. I'm going to hit export. It's going to export it to documents. I'm just going to grab the name Battlefield 1. Now it's a dot reg. So I'm going to hit save. Now, I'm going to go to uh, Documents, and here we have it. Now, you would want to use, this is Windows 11, so you can go to Open With here. Um, but if you're using Windows 10, you can go to, your menu should look like this. If you have Notepad++, that is definitely the one you want to use. But for those who don't have it, you can just use Notepad. It's a little bit more tricky. Now, in here, we're going to be changing the path directory. So, let's go back here. Let's grab the location for the new one. It's in saved games. So, I'm just going to right-click on it, go Properties. This is the new path. I'm going to copy that. Now I'm going to put that new path in. Now they have double slashes everywhere, so I'm just going to keep that going. I'm going to hit paste, and I'm going to go in here and just add these second things everywhere. And there. Now this should have moved the location that it can recognize. So I'm just going to go up here. I'm going to hit export as and it's going to be .txt so I'm going to go all files and then I want to re-add the .reg now just to confirm that's right this is properties .reg okay yep now, I'm just going to hit save. Well, I should change the name. Save. Now, actually, I'm going to go refresh in here. There it is. I'm going to just one, rename it. Now, 
if we go back in here into regedit, we can delete Battlefield 1. Yes. Now I'm just going to click there on EA. Now I'm going to go import. Let's grab the newly modified one. Open. Okay. And it's back. Now we close that. Has our file finished transferring? Not quite. So we'll just have to fast forward. Now that the file transfer has happened successfully, we're going to go back to E. This is the original uh, path. And we could just, normally you just want to delete this, but because I might want to move it back in the future and I have the extra space here, I'm just going to make a new document and I'm going to move it. So now that it's gone, we can reopen origin. It'll be on the SSD. So, well, I mean EA, we can reopen EA. And let's go to Battlefield 1. Now it should be able to play. And it should load a lot faster than it did last time. And now, if you wanted to move it back, it would just be reversed. Here, end task, end task. I'm going to go here to documents. I'm going to get this one. Uh, SSD. You got to go here. Do that. Do that. I got that back to where it was originally. Now let's go here. This is C, so the SSD. Now, new document. Oh, sorry. Hit one here some time ago. There we go. And now we should go to reject it. Yes. Let's delete this. Yes. Click EA again. Import. There we go. Now, if we launch EA again, it should be back in its original location. Oh, do I do the update again? Ah. Did I move the wrong one? Ah, uh, yes, of course. We gotta go back in to here and bring it back. Close the A. Now we can get back into the E drive. Now launch. And there it is. Now, as it plays, it's probably gonna want to do an update. 